Hey guys, I just got back from the grocery store for like the 70 millionth time this week. So stick around if you want to check out what's in my grocery haul all while having a whole lot of fun. I think that's everything you can see, including you can see my sink full of really dirty dishes that I've got to get to. Hey Crack Posse, I just got back from the grocery store and Mikey asked me to quickly take a grocery haul to kind of give you behind the scenes for a um, website, a recipe website like we have. Um, if you are new here, I'm Chris from RecipesThatCrop.com and usually you see my husband Mikey here in the kitchen cooking up all kinds of yummy slow cooker recipes. But today, I'm here showing you what I just got back from the store with. So here we've got laid out the groceries before I'm gonna go rush and put them in the um, refrigerator. And most of this is refrigerated stuff because I have most of the pantry stuff already. I just needed to go grab some refrigerated stuff. So right, what you're seeing right now is enough um, stuff to test out five different recipes that I've been working on. Um, so I've been kind of, figuring out what we wanted to put what what new things we need coming up on the blog and so one of the things that i'm going to test i found these which um, are frozen um, broccoli and cauliflower bags and they were like really inexpensive they were only dollar a bag so i'm going to try one of our favorite ways to cook up um, some vegetables and do our parsley butter with it, our parsley garlic butter, and see if I can make a really yummy slide. So that is um, one of the things I'm testing. And so of course I had to grab me some butter and some parsley. Um, another thing I'm testing is um, um, cooking some of our spaghetti squash that we love um, in the slow cooker and adding some of our favorite seasonings um, to that as well. So that's another test that's going on. I wasn't really happy with my selection today. I got one itty bitty and one big, so we'll see. But that's all right. So those are the sides that I'm testing. And then I've got a one pot meal over here that's gonna be a new pot roast um, that I'm really excited to test. And I'm testing it with zucchini and squash because I know anyone that has a garden this time of year has tons of zucchini and squash to deal with. So I think I found a way to kind of make a yummy twist on a couple of our different recipes. So that's what you've got here and that's what the celery and the mushrooms and the rosemary and the thyme and then um, some of our mixed packets here for that. I'm also testing out um a country style rib recipe um that um our readers have asked me for years to put a country style rib recipe on the site so i've got one that i think i'm i, th I think i'm honing in on and it's bacon wrapped and so we're using that super thick bacon um, and so I can't wait to see how that turns out and I'm pretty sure Mikey's going to be really excited about that too. Um, last but not least, I'm doing another twist on one of our favorite meatloafs, but I'm um, doing it just a little bit differently and um, we are, I think I'm going to combine a couple um, and going to do a cheesy meatloaf in the slow cooker. So those are the recipes that's five recipes and i need to hurry and get this stuff in the refrigerator so that it doesn't spoil on me but that's pretty much um that's pretty much the haul i hope this is what mikey was wanting me to do for you guys today um he has been working really hard um uh in his job and a lot of things have been going on so he's kind of asking me to help um get some of the videos out so um that's what I had to share with you guys today. So is there any of these things that you're especially looking forward to? Now I can't promise that they're going to make it on the site because we do test every recipe before it gets on the site and if it doesn't pass muster it doesn't get on the site. Sometimes we keep working on the recipe until we get it to where we want but it might be months down the road. So I'm hoping that we've got some winners here. So, um, so, but thank you so much for joining me. If you like this kind of video, if you like seeing kind of behind the scenes of what's going on with the site, if you could give this a thumbs up, that we'd appreciate it. 
um, and make sure you subscribe so you can um, know anytime we've got yummy crock pot recipes with um, your regularly scheduled program Mikey here um, and we just love to have you a part of our community that calls themselves the crock posse so thanks for joining me today guys and I'll see you later bye um, behind the scenes behind the scenes behind the scenes yes behind the scenes mm, I don't know about this hey that's not too bad except you can't see the groceries. Okay. Okay, that's just crooked. I think my head's cut off, but I can't really see because the lights are so bright. So if you want to check out what's in my... Mm -mm 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 -mm. Hey guys, I just got back from the grocery store from... The 70 millionth time this week. So if you want to check... So stick around for like the 70 millionth time this week. So check. All while having a whole lot of fun. That worked. Woo! Yay, Addie's yaying for me. Oh, it's been a day.